Hi everyone, this is Piyush Gupta from IBM Storage Development Team. Today in this video, I'm going to talk about three side data application feature of Spectrum Virtualize, which got recently released with version 8.3.1. As you know, in today's enterprise environment, having more than two active data copies is of paramount importance for various reasons, like for site maintenance, for link failure handling, for disaster recovery, for load balancing, and even for compliance reasons too. Let's look at how the solution work. As per the solution, there are three sites having a spectrum virtualized cluster systems at each locations. These three sites are primary site or master site, aux near site or a bunker or a near DR site, aux far site, or a DR site. As per the design, primary site and the aux near site it are at zero RPO because like, you can see that the volume on these two sites are in metro mirror relationship, which is a synchronous replication technology of Spectrum Virtualize. While aux far site is at a user defined non zero RPO because we are using global mirror for the application to uh, Oxfar site, which is a asynchronous technology of replication from Spectrum Virtualize. This feature is supported on all SVCN flash systems uh, appliances, so currently supported with Spectrum Virtualize 8.3.1. Now let's look at how the solution is deployed. You see the three sites primary, Oxnear, and Oxfar having a Spectrum Virtualized cluster each. The link between primary site and Oxnear site is used for synchronous data replication, so is always an active link. Link between primary site and Oxfar site is termed as left channel, while link between Oxnear site and Oxfar site is termed as right channel. At any given point of time, either left channel or right channel would be active while the remaining would be a standby link. By now, you would have seen another fourth element in the diagram called Orchestrator. Orchestrator is a external program connected with these three sites using an SSH tunnel. Orchestrator is deployed for configuration and management of three site data replication solution. Orchestrator can be deployed on a RHEL based host system. It's in a lightweight and a stateless application which is delivered in a form of an RPM. Now let's look at two possible topologies of three site configuration, which is star mode and cascade mode. In star mode, the left channel, which is a connection between primary and OXFAR, is used for replication while the right channel remain in standby link. And in cascade mode replication, left channel is in standby link while the right channel is being used for the replication traffic. Now let's look at a few prerequisites. Make sure you have a remote copy partnership established between all the three systems. Make sure three side orchestrators host system is deployed using an RHEL host machine or a virtual machine running version 7.5 or higher. Ensure an IP connectivity established between orchestrator system and all the three spectrum virtualized cluster systems. And firewall is also appropriately configured to allow an SSH tunnel. Uh, orchestrator RPM is available on IBM Fix Central website, which you can download. Three site solution presently is delivered through an RPQ process. So please get in touch with your IBM sales representative if you are interested in the solution. Or you can write to me on the email ID flashing on your screens if you need more technical details. Thanks for watching this video. Bye bye for now.